to talk about how to claim your blog with Technorati. Now, if you're unfamiliar with Technorati, what it is is basically a search engine for blogs. And by claiming our blog, we're allowed to add a description about the blog as well as throw in some tags, which categorizes our blog in certain categories. Now, this is very, very useful for whenever our site has a lot of backlinks and your site's been up for a while because it'll allow you to rank higher inside of Technorati. So now that we know what Technorati is and why we want to claim our blog, let's talk a little bit about authority. Now, this is just a brief little warning about Technorati and the concept of authority. With Technorati, they base your blog on authority. And what authority is for Technorati is links back to your website. So if you've got a lot of backlinks to your website, you're going to have a high authority. If no one's linking back to your website, you're not going to have any authority. So what this means is if you just created your blog or you ran your website and it hasn't been out for long, then you're not going to have any authority. They calculate authority based over a six month period of time and the backlinks come into your blog. So chances are if you're just getting started or even if you've been up for a month or so, you're not really going to have that many backlinks and as such you're not going to have any authority. So what you're going to have to do is work on that. Now in my course, Blog in an Hour, I talk a lot about things that we need to do in the beginning that gets us to where we want to be in the end. This is one of those concepts where we do something now and it doesn't help us now, but it'll help us six months from now or three months from now or later on down the road. So we really want to do this and we want to do this as soon as possible. Ideally, as soon as you have your blog, you're going to want to go ahead and claim it with Technorati. That way you can start building up and you already have it in your account and you can start tagging it. So whenever you start getting backlinks, it's already been taken care of and it's already set up. So now that we know what Technorati is, what authority is, I'm going to go ahead and go through a quick little overview of the steps that you need to do to claim your blog. First, you're going to have to log into your dashboard of your blog. And the article at enlightenedwebmastery.com, I explain all this in detail, and it assumes WordPress, but you do the exact same thing if you're using Blogger or any, any other platform out there. Now, if you got a magazine-style theme, chances are you're not going to have a sidebar on your home page and that's not going to work with Technorati so what I recommend is editing your footer file which is usually footer.php which you can find in your theme folder in wp-content and edit that file and then when we're done we'll delete it but if you got a regular type blog or you do not have access to that you're going to want to make sure you have widgets on your front page and then you can add that link Another example, which I didn't discuss in the article, is you can just edit a post and add the link to the end of it, and then after your blog's been confirmed, you can go back and delete the post. I mean, delete the edit. I don't want you to create a new post, because if readers are subscribed via RSS feed, they're going to see the new post, and then it's going to be gone, and it can just cause problems. So go ahead and log into your dashboard, and then you need to go to technorati.com and sign up. Once you do that, you choose to claim your blog, and then you enter the URL for your website. It's going to give you a few steps to do, such as they want you to copy and paste the code and then click done when you're done. So whenever you're finished, what you need to do is set up the blog, the blog profile. To do this, you write a brief little description, no more than 250 characters, and then you create 20 tags, which is like your categories. Now, even if your website covers just a very, very specific genre, such as dog training or dog breeding, you still want to try and fill up them 20 tags if you can. So maybe if you only really have about 10, maybe 15 tags for your blog, you could fill up the other five with just being more specific, like Pomeranian dog grooming, or Shih Tzu dog training, Poodle dog training, or dog breeding, or dog grooming, whatever your blog is about. So once you've done that, your blog is now set up, it's descriptive, and it has tags, and you've claimed it. So another thing you can do is go ahead and create your account, well, you already have your account, but create your profile and add your picture. That way you can start interacting with more people and create new friends. So I hope you've enjoyed this article or this video, and I encourage you to go ahead and do this today. Again, you can check out the entire article at enlightenedwebmastery.com, and it's the link should be next to this video. So another thing you can want to start doing is after you've done this is you want to start getting some backlinks to your website. You can go ahead and go to my website now at enlightenedwebmastery.com and comment on this post. And when you comment on this post and you leave your website URL name inside the comment, not inside the actual text, but inside your name, 
you're going to get a backlink to your website. Now, in order for this to be effective, you can't just go around posting random con comments on people's websites and their blogs. You have to give an insightful post or ask a question, leave a comment, or you can give peanbacks to the website, something like that. You don't necessarily have to leave just a post, and the point is you don't just say, hey, great article, thanks, though that's nice. You say, oh, wow, thanks, I really got some use out of using this, this, this. I'm starting to apply this, this, and this. Or I have a question about this. How can I implement that? That's what you want to do. That way people will see your article, realize, I mean, they'll see your comment, realize it's a good comment, and they might click on your link to find out more about you. You don't just say, hey, cool, man, and leave a link to your website because that's spammy, and most people will delete that from their blog if they're paying attention. So go out, claim your blog and start posting some insightful comments on people's blogs and then maybe the author of that blog will read your blog and then link back to you which will help increase your visibility in Technorati as well as other search engines so I hope you've enjoyed this video and you can always rewind if something was a little confusing or you can go to enlightenedwebmastery.com and read the full article which is about a thousand words and explains everything in detail so that way you make sure you understand every single topic and you can follow along while you're reading the guide. So thanks again and have a good day.